Hi guys, my name is Leomi Anderson. Welcome to CrackChannelCops.com and today I'm bringing you the Black Model Survival Kit. As you may or may not know, being a black model is just extra hard. There's extra work, there's extra things involved. So I'm just going to give you my survival kit as to what I've used to save my life from hair and makeup and just black model life mishaps. Well, one major thing is obviously the makeup. You may sit in a chair with someone who's not that experienced with black skin. They may have your best interests at heart, but when you look in the mirror, you're just seeing mad grey, mad ash. And as much as you, you know, you don't want to be rude, you have to explain sometimes like, oh, is it possible to warm up this part of my face? Or is it possible for you to, you know, add a bit more concealer? Like you have to be vocal because the worst feeling in the world is knowing that you're about to go on the runway and look shit. So one thing that I always carry around with me is the MAC Pro Conceal and Correct Palette in Dark. This thing is a lifesaver because it has every single tone that you kind of need to correct your makeup. Um, here's a tip, if you're like me and you happen to get the kind of like the beard with the lighting where the bottom half of your face looks really dark or really ashy. I would suggest using the orange in this palette just for those sections that appear really dark. And then you're gonna put your actual foundation color on top and keep blending. It's gonna warm up your face a lot and then when you see your runway pictures, you won't have that beard. That leads me to the next problem, which is hair. This is the Lustrous Pink Holding Spray. Um, I always, always say to, you know, or ask hairdressers, is it possible for you to use my hairspray instead of yours? And you have to remember that you can't approach these people in a kind of an aggressive way or talk to them like you know more than they do, even though you do, obviously, because it's your own hair. Um, because at the end of the day, they're also trying to do their job, but you have to kind of come to a compromise. So yeah, yeah, Lustrous Pink Holding Spray is great because it's easy to brush out, it's gentle on black hair um, and it actually does its job as well. A lot of shows they um, want to do a wet look and obviously for white or Caucasian hair um, you would use gel and they see your black head and they go well sorry honey we're gonna have to put gel in it blah 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 and if you watched my snapchat last season then you would have followed the story about the hairdresser who wanted to give me a wet look and put gel in my hair little recap basically the hair was like a wet look messy tied back whatever i went to a hairdresser i said boom you're not putting gel in my hair um but i brought with me my l'oreal extraordinary hair oil which will give the wet look he said fine cool put loads of it it looked exactly the same as everybody else bearing in mind i'm not only black girl on the show my hair's done now looks the same go over to makeup some woman comes over to me um you need to go to the head hairdresser to get the gel put on because your hair's gonna go dry in like five minutes i said no nah, it's not gonna go dry put a lot of oil she said no but it's gonna go dry in like 10 minutes so you need to put the gel i said no nah, i'm not putting gel because my hair's already done it looks the same as everybody else's and she comes with why do you think that you need to have different products to everybody else i said babes i'm a complete different race of course i need different products she was like Whoop. and everyone started laughing at her obviously because she's a joke and um then she was like oh so you're not gonna do it then i said no i'm not my hair's already done she's like i'm gonna call your agency boom whatever my phone starts ringing my book is like uh leone um i'm kind of hearing that you're causing a disturbance at work so what's up I said blah blah blah, my hair looks the same, blah, 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 blah. had to send pictures of somebody else's hair and my hair and that's when it got resolved because my hair was already done. But back to the original point, bring your own hair oil. I use the L'Oreal Elvive Extraordinary Oil, it's great for your hair, gives them the shine that they want and you know obviously your hair's not going to be fucked up with gel so just bring an oil. If you can get clippings guys please do bring them with you because there's been a couple of shows where um, the hairdressers don't have clippings or they might not have clippings in your colour and then they'll be talking about oh can we um, glue extensions in and obviously me I'm a fighter so I'm like mm, nah not really blah 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 but I know there's so many scenarios that you know with every black model that could have been prevented if they just brought their own clippings. When you get changed backstage at shows sometimes they will give you guys or give all the models nude underwear nude underwear 
I'll go to my rack and I'm seeing some pasty ass thong and I just look at the people and I'm just like, this isn't my colour. Obviously, they're telling all the models to put the nude on underwear on so it doesn't show through clothes. But, you know, dark skin with light underwear shows a lot more. So always carry with you or wear your own nude thong. And obviously I have to dig up my favourite nude underwear for dark skin tones. Nubian skin lingerie. Um, you can order their stuff online, they ship worldwide. Um, if you're American, they're available in Nordstrom now, I believe. Yeah, it would just save you a lot of stress if you already come prepared. Um, during fashion week, I always wear nude underwear. Edge control. I don't have one with me, I'm going to buy some tomorrow, but always roll with it always have it with you because again they'll be like oh can we just put some gel on the uh no just whip out your edge control that will have you sorted you know your edges will be looking fire and without the use of gel i hope you enjoyed this video and if you're a new model or you know you're thinking about becoming a model please let me know if this video was helpful and let me know what else you want me to talk about on my channel thank you for watching guys bye